infinite love and life and good vibrations, infinite rises, infinite, infinite, infinitely yours. Oh, this had to be a nightmare. Maybe that's what I get for posting that, that video about worshiping false gods. I dreamed that I went to another trap convention like it was people that was there. And they were like, what are you here for? Why do you keep coming back? Yeah, we got them trapped. You better be glad you not trapped. And I ain't gonna lie. In my dream, it seemed like in the dream, it was like you on a magic plane, right? Because I did dive in yesterday. I don't even know uh, how much I took, but I took some. But anyhow, when I when I went there, it was like this dungeon. And they were like, how you get here? You don't supposed to know where this is at. Who sent you? And I like... I could come here, I could I could come here anytime I please, but in actuality I couldn't. It was only certain times that I could get to this portal. And the man who was there, oh man. Oh, excuse me. He was so mean to the women and children. I mean he really literally had them entrapped. And he almost had me afraid for a second. In this dream, now this is just a dream, you guys. This is not nothing to be taken seriously. I think I had that dream simply because I had posted that uh, false god video. Yeah, and they were like, okay, got something for you when you get to the dream side. But yeah, I went down there, and he was in the house, and he had all those people in trap and. They were like, you can't, you, you gonna, you gonna help us get out. But then I realized I wasn't the one who could help them. They had to help themselves get out. It was like a, a, a prison. And he had them trapped there with their mind. And they didn't even know they was trapped. This was not, I ain't gonna lie. This was an amazing dream. Thank you, shrooms. Cause I, I had a clarity, like. The dream was so clear. It, it was just as real as me talking on this microphone right now. I couldn't, you know what I'm saying? Like in most dreams I have, I know I'm dreaming, but in this one, this one was more lucid. I had on all my black gear. <laughs> and I kept coming down, you know what I feel like when I kept going in that dimension. But you are going into other dimensions when you sleep. It's like six something in the grand rising. So that's why I'm kind of low. Because, listen, uh, yeah, it, it's still, it's still kind of early. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, you are entering another plane uh, dimension when you are going to sleep. You're like, how you get here? I felt like Dr. Strange when he kept going back. And the, and the most were like, how you get? He kept changing it. That's what I felt like. I felt like I kept going down into this dimension, right? But every time I go down into this dimension, it's like we repeating it, right? We repeating it. I keep coming. He keeps saying, how you get? And I said, because I can, because I want to, but not knowing that. Well, I knew, but I wasn't going to tell him it's a certain portal that opened at a certain time, and I could get through here and drop down. And the people, they wanted me to save them, right? They was standing, like, behind. They was, if you look at it, like, if you ever seen the fog, that's how the people look. They look like they was in the fog, disoriented. And he was like, these are my bitches. <laughs> I was like, damn. The children, men, and all, everybody was scared. He was like, these are my my bitch. <laughs> I, don't want, I don't want nobody to be my bitch. You know what I'm saying? But he said, <coughs> excuse <coughs> that those were his bitches. And some kind of way I figured out, like, Dang, the only way they could get themselves out of this, they have to uh, evaluate their consciousness. So uh, that dream, and he was a, 
you know what? He kind of, I don't know, he, he was a, and maybe that's what I get for reading all those African stories last night. Oh, man. Anyhow, yeah, that's just a little bit of my dream I had. I don't know if I should call them the shadow men or something, but they sure didn't want me down in their dimension. They were like, how you got the hell you get down here? What you doing here? You don't even supposed to be here. And I'm like, hey, I'm here now where the people at, and I could see them. But at this time, it was like, dang, they was really, like, trapped there willingly on their own. And I I don't think I have nothing to say, and I'm out. And I'm going to title this, uh, I don't know, shoot, I'm out.